Hello, people of the internet! My name is Johnny, and it is my honor to finally welcome you all to Bendy in the Dark Revival. This guy doesn't seem so friendly, though. He's growling at me. I don't really like it. I wanted to do a fun, happy intro, because, hey, we're finally playing the new Bendy game. Woo! But he doesn't sound too happy about it. This game came out at, like, 2 or 3 a.m. my time, and honestly, I was up until, like, 4.30, just lying in my bed, staring at the ceiling, just waiting for the morning where I could get to play in this goddamn game, because I'm so, so, so excited to finally hop into it. And I'm also really looking forward to having a blind experience for something brand new in the Bendy franchise. So, here we go. Ooh, choose your difficulty. Easy if you're new to the studio. Normal if you visited the studio before. I'm guessing if you've played uh, Bendy and the Ink Machine then. If you have mastered the studio. Ooh, how spicy are we feeling? You know what, dude? Hard mode. New Bendy game. Let's just, let's go for hard mode. Why not? Oh my gosh. Joey Drew Studios presents. We're always free to choose. To believe what we want to believe. But when you step back. When you really look at Is that Joey's apartment? And the things you've done. Your past will come. <laughs> to devour you. Wow. Okay, what an intro secrets. Thank you, Audrey. So that's the brand new uh, protagonist of Bendy. And I believe she works at Archgate Pictures, which has acquired all of the uh, the bendy media in, in the game's uh, universe. June 18th, 1973. There she is. Employee of the month, too. Hardworking girl. Animating bendy. Wow. Yeah. Go, little guy. And only... <laughs> No way I'm getting through tonight without some coffee. Probably some downstairs. Look, she's got Alice and Bendy and Boris, too. References. There's the picture from the ending of the first game. My little devil darling. It feels good to be back. All right. Let's stand up. For a little adventure. <laughs> New objective. Locate the elevator. All right. Yeah, so here is Archgate Pictures, which I'm sure we're going to learn a... But... Ooh. I can search the drawers. Nothing in them, apparently. Yeah, Archgate Pictures in this um, version of the Bendy universe, it looks like, has actually acquired all the rights to Bendy from Joey Drew Studios after they went bankrupt. And I believe... Oh, there's a mirror. Hello, there's us. And I believe uh, this was all found out through, like, newspaper clippings that the Bendy uh, Twitter account had tweeted out before this game's release. But here's Audrey. Uh, looks to be an animator at Archgate Studios. And, uh, our brand new protagonist for the game. I'm very excited. Wow. So this is our studio. I will say, I'm loving how this game looks already. Oh, look at this, too. I went to press escape to check how the video's recording. And we got a fully fledged... Ooh, I don't want to do that. Uh, like, escape menu. Featuring Audrey. That's so cool. Fire extinguisher, looks like. Uh, I believe all these doors are locked. Looks like it. Thirsty cold drinks. Cola. Uh, seven new. <laughs> it's like seven up. Uh, sprites. Oh, uh, all these non-copyrighted drinks that we can feature in our game. Look at this office. Heavy storm outside. Why are we walking so late is my question. Oh, here's some more Alice Angel drawings. How cute. And are we the only one here? Nathan Arch. Oh, so it looks like Wilson, who we saw in the trailer, isn't actually, like, the head or CEO or, or whatever of Archgate Pictures. That's what I thought, at least. Hmm. Yeah, I'm curious about these. I feel like there's going to be something hitting it, hidden in them at one point. Interesting. Let's keep looking around. More drawings of Bendy and Alice. Here we go. Doesn't look like there's anything in there. Nothing. Nothing. All right, then. Nothing. Oh, no. Good thing I brought my own key today. <laughs> Alright. Already off on a fetch quest. 
Love that. <laughs> no, I'm this here. I'm not doing this now, Bendy. I know your schemes. I'm not falling for them a second time. Yeah, it's a heavy storm outside. What's this? A little boar statue. Where are my keys? Oh, my keys. Whew. Here's the key. Nice. All right, now that we've got our keys, we can hopefully... Aren't we doing all this just to find a coffee machine? After all this, we still have to go back to work. What the heck's up with that? Got it? There we go. Open sesame. Not the most welcoming hallway I've ever seen. Ooh. Something's going down down uh, over there. I do like how there's an autosave. What's Hello? in this way? Is someone there? Ooh, the storm's aggressive outside, Audrey. Alright, nothing in this one-off room. These are all locked. Hello, mysterious broom. Do you have any secrets that you're hiding from me? Here is the elevator. Ooh. This door is slightly ajar. Doesn't look like I can go in. Alright, down the elevator. Oh boy, yep, no, take your sweet, sweet old time. Anyone lurking behind me? Doesn't look like it. Hello, mop. Here we go. Aha. I don't trust, yeah. Wilson, so soon. Oh, is he like the janitor? Okay, that's interesting. Pretty girl like you shouldn't be wandering around all by yourself. Mind if I step in? Yes, I do mind, actually. Take the oh, stairs. Of course not. Thank you, Audrey. You look like you could use a little company. Mm. Okay, I guess... been really nice this past week. Just beautiful. Gorgeous. I, I'm not a fan of Wilson. What was that? Please tell me we're not trapped in here. Don't you worry, my dear. It's just a little short in this system. Happening a lot this past few days. No need to fret. Oh! Let's see what we can find. Come along now. Old Wilson will protect you. I don't like how Wilson speaks to Audrey. I'll keep it a stack, boys. I think it's just a little weird. Anyways. I don't like this. Can you turn on some lights? Is that what you're doing? Are you turning on some lights? Awesome. Hey! There's a familiar Just face. A few more switches to throw. Me. It will be perfectly safe. Usually when someone says it, especially in that tone, uh, it's actually not safe. But here's Joey Drew. Archgate Pictures presents Joey Drew, the man and the demon. Some sort of documentary, I guess. Ooh, Alice Angel framed poster. And Joey Drew. 1901 to 71. Joey Drew was the founder of the studio and the man who created Bendy, one of the most beloved cartoon characters of all time. In 1929, with the help of his business partner, Henry Stein, Steen, still don't really know how to pronounce it, I'm, I'm sorry. He created Bendy's first uh, short, Little Devil Darling, as an early talky cartoon, as his... Thank you, autosave. As his entertainment legacy grew over the years, Joey's optimism, uh, optimism and pioneering spirit never wavered. Starting with just a pencil and a dream, he created this studio. Here at Archgate Pictures, we strive to continue his dream and see Bendy live on. Dreams come true. Are they trying to cover up the fact that Joey Drew Studios existed? Or in this version of the, of the game's lore, in this new game, was he the one who founded Archgate instead of Joey Drew Pictures? But here he is, working on Bendy, 
Nice, nice, nice. Speaking of Bendy, hello. <laughs> wow, look at that. Some tickets, a picture of... What is that? I can't even tell what that is. More pictures. Silly Vision. Uh, Silly Vision is a cartoon format developed by Joey Drew that allowed for animated cartoons to be completed more uh, efficiently by streamlining them, streamlining them. The pencil and inking stages and allowing for last minute adjustments to be made directly on the film stock itself. The film was chemically coated to allow for a uh, specially formatted ink to be applied by an artist walking on a uh, magnifying table. This allowed for adjustments, action enhancements, or even whole new characters to be added after the cartoon had been photographed. Mr. Drew invented, intended for the format to be used someday to create interactive experiences where the cartoons could be custom altered to fit the occasion or audience. How interesting. Some storyboards of Bendy. Looks like uh, Boris has banjo and Boris plush himself. Bendy, sing along. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm sorry. Hello. I recognize this. Book, wrench, gear, ink, music, plushie. Oh! And that too. Uh, hello. Looks like someone's been messing with the exhibits. There should be something on each of these pedestals. Don't make me fetch quest. Audrey. Sweet Audrey. Okay, I'll do it, but don't call me Sweet Audrey. Do an old man a favor and go find to the power. <sighs> really? You're starting the game off with another fetch quest? Alright. Yeah, sure, I'll find them. It looks to be the same artifacts we found in the last episode. I mean, last game. Which, luckily, I do remember. Here we go. Still the same book, The Illusion of Living by Joey Drew. Bendy plushie. Hey, little fella. <laughs> Sweet. Ink. There we go. <laughs> Looking down at us, Joey. Okay, it said search the exhibit, so I feel like they're all going to be in this main room. We need a wrench, a gear, and something else. Oh, here we go. Are we sure we should be taking this odd tree? I feel like that could be... Powering something. Yep, there it is. Bendy goes bankrupt. Okay. Here, well, let's place down the ones we have for now. The plushie. There you go. We have... Oh, the music. I know exactly what that is. And here's the wrench. We got all of them. Come on. A little bit of a pull. There you go. And let's go get this record. And... Oh, here. Very careful. Antique Audrey. You don't want to... Break it. You got it, Wilson? Okay, just making sure. Here's the ink machine. I feel like you're gonna do something to me with that ink machine. Anyways, here's our gear that we stole <laughs> from some power outlet. Our wrench. Very nice. Our book. The Illusion of Living. Music. And quickly, before I put this down, I just want to double check and make sure... I'm not missing any secrets. Um, what's this? Oh, another Boris poster. Wonderful. I don't think I'm missing anything, but just in case. What's this? Oh, sorry, Audrey. <laughs> the, quite the quite the view down there. I did not mean to. I, I didn't, didn't mean to look. I apologize. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll move on with the game. Finally, the ink. And I guess we can just go talk. Okay. Wow. Good thing. I double checked. I did the- I did it. Only one thing left to do. Pull that switch. No. What if I don't want to, huh? What if I don't want to, huh? What are you gonna do about it? Fine. Here we go. Oh, that said flow. It is done. Wilson? Oh, Audrey. The things you set in motion. Is that really all it took? Stay back. Listen 
to me, Audrey. Pay attention to these last words. Because very soon, you will forget everything. Let go! Come find me, Audrey. Come find me, and I'll show you your purpose. I'll show you the truth. This can't be rude. And now, we die. What are you doing? Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh my god. It's finally here. Oh, I can't believe it. I mean, I should be able to. I've been playing it for nearly 20 minutes. Oh, no. What's wrong with my hands? This is actually really terrifying. What's wrong with my hands? Oh, Audrey. What's happened to you? Oh, the sound effects too. Oh my god, I feel so bad. New objective, escape the studio. Every great story begins in mystery. Although things may be dark at the start, the truth will illuminate your way. Don't be afraid of who you are. Fear only what you have become and banished away your best pal. Memos are stored in the pause menu. Wonderful, there she is. There's Inky Audrey. Maybe I should find a better name. Okay. Who is our pal? Boris? What's in here? To Grant Cohen, accounting. Please inform Mr. Drew that despite his insistence that the rumors of Joey Drew Studios going bankrupt are untrue, I want to remind him that if the studio does indeed fail, all equipment and experiments produced uh, through our partnership by contract belong to the Gent Corporation. We will reclaim these assets forcibly, if necessary. Alan Gray, CEO of Gent, which I believe is on our little device we should get later on in the game. Ooh. I wonder if these will allow us to upgrade ourselves or weapons later on in the game. I'd love that. I do hear someone crying. Relax. The man who killed the ink demon. Wilson knows your purpose. So I wonder if this is like a false reality or like a some reality that Wilson has created. Uh, where can I go? There's a ladder. Oh, I gotta fix the ladder. Dang it. So I, it's not about upgrading weapons. There you go. Nice. And up we go. Oh, I... Interactive. Like that. Now we're up here. Got a music box? What for? Oh. <laughs> That's cute. I like that. Uh, geez, you think I was drowning kit- <sighs> What the hell? You think I was drowning kittens the way these people are looking at me. I've never seen such disappointment in a person's eyes. But this is the way of things. If management can't pay their bills, then the bank takes the goodies back. Still, it does break me a bit knowing how much I love them old cartoons this place used to make. Oh well, times change, life moves on, Telly Wester. Meeting a whole bunch of new characters. I wonder if it's going to pay off in the end. See to crouch? Definitely would love to remap that later on. Two hundred eleven. That's not even a year. I banished him away, tore his body in two. In return, I ask just a little favor. Among you, there 
A young lady. Bring her to me. Okay. So Wilson wants everyone in this inky world to probably get us. That's great. Ooh, Joey. This is from Sammy. We know Sammy. And I think we also know Jack. I think he had an audio log down in the sewers of chapter two. Joey, Jack, and I have been wondering if uh, you could meet us considering the current situation. We have been with you for many years and we feel we have contributed to the success of Bendy in the past. Our interest is purely in keeping this company strong. We just want to uh, help however we can. Let's talk from Sammy Lawrence, who, as we all know, goes on to become a worshipper in a cult for the Ink Demon. And who we killed twice in the main game. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. Crouch under this. Going very slow, Audrey. Am I supposed to be going this way? Okay, here we go. Picking up the pace. Where is this ink coming from? Looks like another note. Hello, Bendy. Don't mind me. Oh, the ink drips. Darkness has spread through the studio. The reaching, the shadows creep around you. Something hungers for your corrupted flesh. It is close, so very close. It strains to grab you, choke you from behind. You will feel its breath upon your neck. It is close. Bendy, I'm, I'm scared, man. And I don't like this. Gent parts. Okay, so surely I can use those to upgrade. <laughs> right? The Butcher Gang! Oh, speaking of the Butcher Gang... You have seen better days! Okay. Okay, how wonderful. Audio log. Why did they get rid of subtitles? Some crap department downtown. You practically hear the rats through the telephone when he called me last April. In spite of that, old Joey sounded quite happy when last we spoke. More like the excited, hopeful young man I knew once upon a time. Well, farewell, my friend. What will become of your creations now? Okay, so that was Noah Ark, the dude we saw a portrait of earlier on in the game. I do wonder, there was an option to listen later. Oh, okay. I'll make sure to do that for next time. I apologize. Luckily, captions are in the menu. Bud Lewis. Or Louise? I couldn't quite make it out. Memories are stored in the pause menu. Wow, there's so much. Baseball. A baseball signed by the legendary Bud Lewis. This would make an uh, exciting gift for any young baseball fan. Okay, yeah, sure. Uh, not quite sure why that's so important. But, uh, I guess that's another thing to collect. That's kind of cool. I like collectibles. Uh, climb up this way. Okay, and we're up once again. There's a power switch. Anything in here? I didn't mean to hide. I thought it was a locker I could search. Uh, just like this. And there's nothing. All right, let's throw this. Security override. Oh, why'd you give me the run? Who the hell was even that? Who was that? Why the lights go out? Okay. Tasty eats. Treats that can't be beats. Book. Bendy. Okay. <gasps> oh, the void. Oh, the void came into existence. Oh, a split pathway. Doesn't matter which one I take. Uh, it looks like it, but not in the way I thought. <gasps> Heavenly toys! Oh my god, wait, it looks so, so good! God dang! A battery? Oh my god, look at this! Look at the new poster for Alice, too. Oh, this place looks amazing. Little miracle station's back. What's in this? Ooh, a note. As the winds are changing around here, I'm asking myself, Sean, 
Oh, wait, this is Sean Flynn. There's a whole world out there. Places to see. I really shouldn't be doing this. A family to spend me days with. This here job is just a job. I have others like it. Not worry about, not worrying there. But the important thing is, we should remember to live. I think it's time we, I did just that. I'm Sean Flynn. I'm sorry if that deeply offended you. I shouldn't have done that. That deeply offended me too. Ooh. Oh, a locked door. Can't go down there. This Boris plushie is blocking my path. So I guess we'll head out this way. There is a stamina meter. Which I'm a little concerned about. This... Whoa! I was gonna say this switch is in the same place it is in the main game. Out of order. Oh... Okay. Can we climb up here? You betcha. And hopefully we can find another power switch! Oh my god! Hello? Oh, run and hide. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, wow, he's actually really fast. Little miracle station. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, <laughs> Alice. Alice. Is he gone? Ooh, food. Low in health, grab a snack. Survival will mean some dangerous situations. When you are low in health, you will need to eat. Locate hidden food stashed around the studio. Okay, and so we can see our health bar down there. Let's find some food. Whoa, careful there, Audrey. Running down the stairs, you could hurt yourself. You could fall and trip. Oh, it's right here. Bacon soup. Oh, it's empty. Nope, that was definitely empty. Oh, <gasps> Allison! But the aftertaste, it's not so good. Easy now, I'm not gonna hurt you. It looked like you needed some help. Don't touch me. What are you? Ugh, what is this horrible place? Yeah, I remember my first day down here. I know, it's scary. But you're actually pretty lucky. She looks so good! Turned you into a searcher. You mean that... That thing that attacked me? No, no, that's a piper. And he's part of a gang, so be careful. I don't understand any of this. I can't think. It hurts. You'll catch on pretty quickly, if you can stay alive. That's not Lesson reassuring. Time. Searchers don't have legs, and they tend to swarm. Look, it's not good to stay in one place for too long around here. Keep moving, and stay close to the shadows. Take my advice. Head to the upper levels. It's safer there. Can I come with you? You can't. I'm sorry. I have a wolf. <gasps> he doesn't care for strangers. Tom. Like I said, you'll catch on. Good luck. I hope we meet again. I hope so too. Oh, and one more thing. Above everything else, stay away from the ink demon. What's what an, an ink, ink demon? demon? Oh, you'll know him when you see him. <laughs> he likes to smile. And he kills anything that moves. Wait! What's your name? They call me Alice. But I'm no angel. I'm not very fond of it. Damn. I'm Audrey. Well, Audrey. Welcome to the studio. Oh. The expressions, the animation, God, it's all so, so good. And, uh, like, let alone the environments. Like, look at this. That's, like, genuinely insane. Anyways, I think that's what I'm going to call it now for this first episode. And I'm so, so, so gassed. It feels so good to be back playing Bendy. And I know I just replayed the first one. But this is already so, so good and so unique. I love it so much. I know a lot of people have been very, very um, split or just straight up against the, uh, the studio behind this game, which absolutely fair. But also, and I think I kind of said this when Poppy Chapter 2 came out, like, you can hate the studio, but goddamn, have they put their hearts and soul into this project. And it looks like it's already paying off. That's going to do it for this first episode of Bendy in the Dark Revival. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. And I can't wait to see you all very, very soon for chapter two.